Hello everyone, welcome to English in my way. How are you? I've I've just changed my setup, you know. I hope you really like it and if you're looking where my dog is, I think she's just there taking a nap. She'll be there like you know, just don't get distracted by her. If you really like her, you can you are welcome to look at her, okay? Uh so today it's going to be an English content and uh, I'm sure you're going to enjoy not just enjoy you're going to love it. Yes, love it because the content itself is going to be about love, expressing love to someone. I am sure you would have often looked for some unique ways in which you can express your love to someone and impress them, right? Sometimes it's usually a normal I love you, but most of the times we want to say it in a way in which uh, you you impress the people whom you are trying to tell. So, let's go and see what are the ways uh before i get into the topic i want to try and clarify something here that is uh some people often misunderstand love to be a relationship between people whom you're romantically uh in relationship i mean only with people you can love only people whom you are in romantically attracted or attached so that's not accurate you can love anyone you can love anything i i can say i love my dog right likewise you can say you you can say and you can love anything or anybody right uh with that said let's move on to the topic and see different ways in which you can say i love you so i'm going to be referring some uh some content to my ipad like you know so i'll be just looking uh rather than before i used to try and memorize and like you know kind of recreate it but i'm going forward i'm going to be i'm trying to be natural right uh if what let me know what you think you know if you like this kind of videos or uh, you want you like the way uh, i did it before the first one is i love you i love you it's a sweet and simple and very easy to remember and i'm sure most of you watching this would have used it at at least one at least a point in your life to anybody okay and do not confuse you can use this to anyone right i love you to anybody to your family your friends anyone it not you don't need to confine it to people whom you are romantically in love okay now let's move to the next one that is i am in love with you this is this phrase is bit more intense than just i love you and you can say it only to people whom you are in romantically in relate romantically related that means you can tell it only to your boyfriend girlfriend like your partner your husband wife like that right so uh do not tell it to your great aunt i am in love with you that will sound scandalous okay let's move on to the next one you are the love of my life wow you are the love of my life so with that like you know can you feel what this means like you know the sentence itself is you're the love of my life which means you're making a declaration declaration that you want to live the rest of your life with them until uh, unless you don't feel that you're go- you would want to spend the rest of your life with them do not say this you're the love of my entire life there's no one beyond that right so as as it entails you can use it only to the person whom you are romantically in relationship with right now let's move on to the next one that is i love you to the moon and back is there any better way of romance than gazing at the moon i don't think so do you like like you know it's my personal choice right everybody has their personal choice so uh with this like you know you mean to say that you love them beyond what like you are you are expressing your love in a very unique way and uh, this this could be used to anybody though back in the days it was used only to people whom you are in romantically in relationship with relationship with but these days it has become a trend that you know between friends they use the strong i love you to the moon and back right let's move on to the next one that is i am crazy about you i am crazy about you this is a modern way of saying i love you and it doesn't always mean that you are deeply in love with them like you know it's not just to express i love you but it all it always means like you like them like that person you like what they do 
who like who they are. So you can say I'm crazy about you to anyone. The next one is I am head over heels for you. Head over heels for you. This is a statement like, you know, you, you can say to someone whom you're deeply, madly, crazily, whateverly in love with. You are so in love with them. You are head over heels, which means head over heels means you're standing upside down. So, which means they, you are, you love them so much. You can express it. I'm head over heels for you, right? Now let's move on to the next one. You are my other half. As the phrase or statement entail, you say, you mean to say they are your other half. You are my other half, which means they complete you. They complete you. You wouldn't say to someone you are my other half if you don't if if you don't feel that they you have some chemistry, right? And you can say it only to people whom you to your partner or your like you know whom you are going to marry or whom you are going to spend the rest of your life. Okay. Uh, and the next one is a very interesting one. You are my sunshine. You are my sunshine. So as the phrase says, you you bring sunshine brings light into light, right? So which if you when you say you are my sunshine, it means you mean to say that you bring light into my life. So you can it's a very sweet way of saying I love you to someone. So these are the unique ways in which you can express your love to someone. Now let's do a quick recap. First one is I love you. Second one is, I am in love with you. Third, you are the love of my life. The, the fourth one is, I love you to the moon and back. Fifth one, I am crazy about you. Six, I am head over heels for you. Seven, you are my other half. Eight, you are my sunshine. So on the internet, you may find like, you know, hundred other ways in which you can say I love you but these are the ways I feel that you know it gives more uh, depth and intensity when you express it right uh, so you can try and use this and uh, let me know if the other person was impressed hopefully you will be able to make a difference to the way of saying a normal I love you I hope you enjoyed watching this video if you did Please hit the sub, like, and bell button. And remember, our channel is all about inspiring people to be confident. Have a wonderful day.